Hello spirits, can anyone hear me right now? I'm giving you, I'm giving you the opportunity, if you're familiar, or just passing through this location, to come forward and let me know you're here by name. Can you do that? The device in my hand you can manipulate and form your voice, your answers. Who's here? How many spirits are around right now here? Can you tell me your names if you're here, please? I'm Stuart. What are your names? Can you please tell me your names clearly? Is that possible? So only so I know if you So only so I know if you've come through before. Are any of you here that have come through before? Robert, Craig, Andrew, Christopher, are any of you here? Can I ask how many spirits want to communicate right now? Or how many of you are here? What is the number of spirits that are around right now that can hear me? I'm going to move on to asking you some questions. You can show your physical interaction using the devices on the floor in front of me, the ball and the REM pod. They both light up if you influence them. Spirits. We assume that when we pass away from our human form, we become a spirit and enter the spirit world. But, is it the spirit world? Or is it an ultimate, alternate di uh, dimension? A parallel universe? Do you exist in the spirit world or an alternate reality dimension? What is it you exist in? What is it called? And all the consciousness carries on. After our physical body passes away. But is it existing in a parallel universe, your consciousness? Do alternate dimensions exist to this one? How many parallel universes are there if they exist? Can you tell me how many exist if they do exist?
this one. I'd like to know, in human form we experience from time to time something called deja vu. Which is kind of like being at a place or doing a certain thing we know we've done before, yet no we haven't. But we know we've done it, if that makes sense. Is that because it's took place before in a previous life or a parallel universe? Do you know what I speak about? Have we done things before in different realities? Is that why deja vu happens? If you're a consciousness now, or a spirit, whichever you want to see yourself as, do you visit different realities and dimensions? Yeah. Like this one I'm in now, the human form, in this dimension, this reality, you can clearly communicate with me in this, but can you visit it physically in your form? Or is it difficult? For instance, manipulating the machines in front of me on the floor, the ball, the REM pod, when you've set them off before, is that when you're breaking through to this reality from yours? You're able to connect here, even if it's briefly. Can you set either of those objects off on the floor right now? Can you manage to do it with your energy? Can you show your presence? Can you come through that door in front of me? Spirits, have you ever heard of the Mandela effect? Have you heard of the Mandela effect? basically means when Nelson Mandela was alive there's a there's a lot of people that remember him dying in prison in the 80s they saw it on the TV his widow gave a speech yet in reality he, he passed away in the 2000s why have some people got a visual memory of seeing it on TV in the 80s when it occurred in the 2000s I think it was 2009 why did that happen? Why does that happen? We refer to it as the Mandela effect. Is it a parallel universe? Crossing over to this one. And all these questions sound far out. But there's more that we don't know and don't understand that occurs we try to find the answers to it so before I go I'll ask again do parallel universes exist spirits? Yes or no? Alternate realities, do they exist?
if you've come through thank you very much it's a shame you didn't interact with the objects on the floor but I guess that could be for another day I'm going to turn this off now thank you spirits goodbye Goodbye, spirits.